This is the textbook project, module 10, and now we're actually going to fill in the form as if we were a user. So if you click the uh, where it has enter your full name in red, if you click that, you can type your name and then tab, or you can click where it has the job title, and the job title will be branch manager and then double click where the hundred is and actually type a different amount 335 and then for the content control click the down arrow and choose today and it'll put in the date that you're currently doing this and then for branch click the down arrow and choose Chicago USA so we're actually using all the the content control for the feedback again click the arrow and choose excellent and um, make sure that if you haven't done it the first time um, I'm gonna have to show you later how to because right now we're it's in a locked position so we can't change this but you need to change your um, it should be resume building networking and in interview so I'll go back to that later so the next thing we're going to do is insert pictures so you'll click the icon for insert picture go to your files where you keep your your um, pictures and you'll select one and then click insert and then you'll click the plus sign to add another picture and then again the content control same place where you saved your file and insert another picture remember we have up to three here and then they just want you to uh, make it just a little bit smaller so in the right corner about the same about an inch so we'll click in the pink box and we, we can't type in it right now so go to developer and they restrict editing and choose stop protection and remember the password and now you can click click in the in the cell and type um, the first one is resume building and then the next one is networking and the last one interview skills and they want you to check presentations and then also check job fairs and then for comments You'll type a phrase in here it was supposed to type it in all caps but I had to put cap locks on And this you'll save and submit to me through Blackboard. And you, if you wanted to um, start the reinforcement again so it's locked in, you can. And again, you'll have to use that same password. And save and submit your completed form. So you made, um, there's the red font. And this will only allow three numbers in the extension. And everything has drop downs if you want to change the date. So you made a simple form into something that gives people options. So go ahead and save and submit.